Today I have the fourth and final $500 Toya Say mystery box. 500 bucks. I bought a total of four of them. You've already seen the first three videos. This is the fourth and final one. Hopefully it's a good one. But in order to start this kind of video, we must first do an appetizer, what I call the appetizer. This video is brought to you by shopzobi.com. Zobi is the home of the first ever V Shout virtual celebrity shout out and autograph program. For one low price, you will get a celebrity to sign an item for you and give you a personal video message. Check out the shopzobi.com website and make sure to use my promo code KIX10 to save 10% off most everything on the website. Shopzobi.com is your number one source for authentic celebrity autographs. This is a $20 Chrono Toy Funko Pop mystery box. Just a cheap mystery box. You, you could lose a few dollars, you could make a few dollars. It's just a very inexpensive kind of mystery box for people to kind of venture into if you just want to have a little fun with the $20 mystery box. You know, no harm, no foul, it's 20 bucks. And sometimes you can actually get pops out worth like, you know, 30, 40, 50 bucks. Sometimes worth 15, it's just, it's all the gamble. There you go, $20 warm up mystery box. Warm up for the big boy box. Here we go, first one. Actually, I've got this thing out multiple times so far. We have the uh, Champa Blocked. This is the Special Edition Overseas sticker, but originally I think this was a Hot Topic exclusive originally. I think it's coming in. I'm going to use the WhatNot app to look up value. I would drop a link down below to download the WhatNot app if you want to uh, buy and sell Funko Pops in a very safe and secure online app platform. 16 bucks PPG. So this one, I lost four dollars. That's okay. Just it's just a warm-up. Just to, you know, have a little fun. So right now we're down four bucks with that pop. But here you go. This is the big boy. All warmed up. So if you saw video number two, you saw me hit this one from the second box. Box number two. Video number two. The Joker Glow in the Dark 480 piece Gemini exclusive. It's worth a thousand dollars plus. This one is pretty much nine out of ten condition. It is near mint to mint condition. The box is fantastic condition for a seven-year-old pop. This was the second best hit out of this 20 box run. I got the second best hit. Go ahead, we'll put this right here for good luck for this fourth and final box. Let me tell you about this box, which you've already heard this thing three times. Toya say five hundred dollar damaged pop high roller edition mystery box. This is an expensive one. Do not buy these kind of boxes if you cannot afford to lose the money. You can lose upwards of $200 on this box. You can lose $200. Each box contains four Funko Pops. It says boxes will have damage to them. Most of it is minor damage, but uh, most pops are like 7.5 or better kind of condition wise. The top hits were the Bank Robber Driver 2 pack. I got that one out already. There is still the Metallic Frankenberry. The Freddy Kylo, which is the top hit, the Freddy Kylo. Freddy Hogan, Bakugo, the con stickered. You got Captain Rex con sticker, a Chaco mast. So you got some, you know, some pretty decent pops you can get out of this box. There is no guaranteed value, but pretty much you can figure out from my videos, other people's videos, that uh, you can lose about 200 bucks on this box. Not everybody's going to get out something like this. This is a rarity. So actually... Fun fact, after the first three boxes, I spent $1,500. Right now, I'm at $1,670 of PPG value. Even getting out this $1,000 pop, I'm only up $170 with the first three boxes. Spent $1,500, I'm at $1,670. Last box. Here we go. What is going to be in this one? Open this thing up upside down because Toya Say uses those packing peanuts, which we all hate. They make a mess everywhere. Do it upside down. You won't have as bad of a mess whenever you open it up. At least you should if, if, if you do it correctly, but you got all your packing peanuts. Here's the box, $500. We'll do this thing upside down so that we cannot see like the top of, of the pops. We're gonna see the bottoms of them to kind of hide the surprise a little bit longer. So fourth, fourth one, final one. But I'm super happy that I at least got out this one. To me, that's a huge win. So I spent a total of $2,000 on four mystery boxes. Two of them, I struck out. I lost 
about 400 bucks on two boxes. This one I hit big on, last one. Let's feel around first. Let's see if I can feel like a pop protector, like a hard stack. Ooh. Oh, wait, wait. Wait a minute. You ready? You got to tap that stack. Hear that? Tap, 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 baby. We got a stacky boy. We got a stacky boy. So the other three pops are not in top pop protectors. They're all loose in here which that is a fantastic sign. You want your pops to, like like your, your, your three bad ones to be in just no pop protectors because that means your stacky boy, your tap, tap, tappy boy could be a big one. Did I hit big again? More than likely, if it's a stacky boy, it's probably one of the bigger hits, but here we go. We'll put this thing over here so we cannot, I can't, I still can't see it. It's like, it's looking that way. I don't want to, I don't want to peek myself. I want to be surprised. Here we go. First one, no pop protector. The back says scary stories to tell in the dark. We have Harold. So pop condition on this first one. It's mint. So far... Pops and these, I haven't, had, I haven't had anything damaged yet. I haven't had anything truly damaged. Most pops have actually been mint condition. I've been very happy with the condition of these pops in this damaged mystery box. Next one, no pop protector. We got Stranger Things. Lucas, yeah, just a common pop one. These first two pops are just common pops worth like eight, 10 bucks each. They're pretty low value pops. And this one also, it's mint. It's mint. I'm not looking. The Joker, he's sliding off his box. Here we go. Last one. No pop protector. We have us. Just the comet is not the chase. And once again, Axis has a small little, it's not a crease. It's like a box flaw, like a manufacturer's flaw. But beyond that, the box actually is like near mint to mint. It's as close to mint you can get. I'm going to close this box up so I absolutely cannot see it no matter what. No editing, no nothing. Actually, just to, to be, I'm going to put the Joker on top of the box. So we, it's not staying shut. So we cannot, nope, he's sliding. Um, I need more weight on it. To hold it down. Is that going to work? Yeah. There. Keep on there for good luck. Let's actually, I'm going to look up the PPG value on the WhatNot app of all these three pops. Then we'll do the last one. The big boy. The stacky boy. Okay. So first one with Pluto. He's coming in. A WhatNot app. $6 PPG. Very cheap. You can actually download the WhatNot app yourself. Drag link down below. You can buy and sell Funko Pops. And it will tell you values of all your pops. You can scan the barcode on your pop box. They are a great sponsor of my YouTube channel, so check them out. 12 bucks, PPG. So first two, we're at, I totally just butchered that. It's $18, clear, $18. And last one on the WhatNot app, the PPG value is $10. So first three pops, PPG is a whole 28 bucks. With a $500 mystery box, that means this last pop, it's a big one. This last pop, it is a big one. So Bank Robber Joker, give us some good luck. I would be totally psyched if it was obviously the top hits left that I didn't hit. Metallic Frankenberry and Freddy Kylo. Those two are the number, or the Freddy Kylo's top hit. Metallic Frankenberry is, is like third best hit. So let's see, what did we get? <laughs> Are you ready for this? You're kind of excited? I'm kind of excited. This feels like it's actually in a seven bucks a pop, pop armor it feels like. That's what it feels like. Is it? Feels like it. I don't know which way's, you know, front, which way's back. Here we go, you ready? What did I get? Oh, the back is a Freddy Funko. What did we get? What did we get? What did we get? What did we get? Oh, sweet. Okay. We got the 500 piece Freddy as Hulk Hogan. 
that's a good hit. It's not one of the top hits, but that's a good hit. That's a nice hit. Actually, it is in a, a, a Sunbucks Pop Pop Armor. I have, have a fill link down below. The Sunbucks Pop, where you can get the best pop shield, soft pop protectors, and these pop armors in my affiliate link. Let's see, what is this worth? Actually, it has no barcode. I have to do a just like a just a random search on it. So on the Whatnot app, this is not sold on the app, but it has a PPG value of six hundred and sixty dollars. That's a good hit. That is way over what I paid for the box. And in terms of like top hits, let me see. Let me figure it out where this was in terms of rank. Uh, looks like okay. Actually, it was looks like. I mean, if you go by the pictures of what, because they, they listed all the contents for all 20 boxes, and by the pictures, this is actually the fourth best hit from the box. So that's awesome. I actually, out of the 20 boxes, I bought four boxes. I got the second best hit and the fourth best hit possible. I'm very happy with that. This is worth PPG of 660 bucks. So this box had a total of $688. I bought it for 500 Plus the original, the first three boxes were worth sixteen seventy, so I spent a total of two thousand dollars. I got back in value two thousand three hundred and fifty-eight dollars. So that's not bad. I mean, I got three hundred fifty-eight bucks more, more than what I paid. Two huge grails, and all these pops over time will be sold on the Whatnot app. I'll either sell it in my Whatnot app store myself, where I sell dozens of pops or i'll sell it live via auction so make sure you follow me on instagram i will notify everybody whenever my, my next whatnot auction is where you can buy pops from me live and battle other collectors auction style so yeah fantastic box super happy second best hit fourth best hit huge scores funko bad guy out